What is up, let people? I'm Armenti and welcome back to another Lumion Legacy video. Guys, in today's video, I'm gonna be seeing how much a developer Lumion is actually worth. Uh, on today's video, I'll be looking for offers on Brat's Blue Up Sidragon, which is the one that I'm walking with right now. As you can see here on the screen, it's a secret ability, clumsy, very clever, sluggish. And here's the Lumion for you guys to see. It's a blue up Sidragon, obviously. And here's the UPs and the TPs. A huge, huge thanks to Brad for lending me his custom Lumion for this video. So now I'm just gonna be looking for offers in the trade resort for what this Lumion could be traded for. Obviously, I'm not gonna be trading this Lumion since it's Brad's custom Lumion and it's one of a kind. But yeah, I'm just interested to see what people offer. Now let's accept Navy Wolf 360's trade. And let's see what he's gonna offer for Brat's Blue Up Sidragon. Let me put it on screen right now. There we go. And now let's wait for them. So they're offering a Gleam Ikazune and a Gleam Silver Elaguana. Is this worth it? Most definitely not. It's a, it's a Gleam Ikazune and a Gleam Silver Elaguana. Obviously nothing is worth this Lumion, but still we just want to see how much people are going to offer for it. Now let's accept a trade from Real Ominous Nebula, also known as Ominous Nebula. So here's the Obsidragon, Brat's Blue Obsidragon. I'm really excited to see what Ominous is going to offer. I think he's the richest player in the whole game, so he might have a good offer. Let's just wait. Okay, so he's offering a Grinch and a Rainbow Twilight, hashtag Rip Ricardo. So now I'm going to be asking you guys, is this worth it? Sorry, Ominous Nebula, but I do not see myself taking your offer if I even were able to trade this away. I really do not think I would have taken your offer. That's just how I felt with it. Uh, let me give more, Ominous Nebula says. Okay, Ominous Nebula is going to be adding to his previous offer, uh, the Grinch and the Rainbow Twilight. So he's offering two Gamma Faraglyphs, and I'm assuming the Rainbow Twilight and the Grinch. Yeah, there we go. So now I'm going to be asking you guys, is this worth it? Sorry, I'm in a Zebula, but no, this is in fact not worth it. Like I said, I don't really know what's worth it or not. Obviously, nothing is worth it since it's a uh, custom developer at Lumion, and it's pretty much just too unique to even have a value. So now let's accept Young Wolf's trade. Let's see what he's going to offer for Brad's Slope Sidragon. So they're pulling up a Gamma Ferroglyph, an Alpha Ferroglyph, another Alpha Ferroglyph. Let's see what else. An Alpha Protagon, an Alpha Duskid, a Grinch, another Grinch, a uh, Gamma Shachi. I'm assuming that's a secret ability Protagon. And yes, their final offer. You know what? It's I think this offer, eh, it's similar to Ominous's offer. Now I'm gonna be asking you guys, is uh, this worth it? Yeah, I do not see myself taking this trade, man. I don't even know what I would even take for Brats of Sidragon. Obviously, I'll be returning Brats of Sidragon after doing a few more videos with it, but I don't even know what's even worth <laughs> for this developer Lumion. It's just a custom Lumion, you know? And it, like I said, nothing will ever be worth this Lumion, and that's the truth. Um, okay, now let's see what Mr. Waffles has to offer. There we go, we have a Grinch as an offer. And I take it that this is the entire offer. So now I'm going to be asking you guys, is this worth it? <music> they ended up adding three Gleam Silver Get Close. However, this offer is most definitely not worth it. Uh, we got offered two Grinches and ads, and we also got offered a Grinch and a Rainbow Rat and ads. So, uh, by far, those are the two best offers we've gotten so far. I do not think that offer is worth it. Now we're gonna take an offer from Diego. Uh, he's offering a Gleam Sapphire, a Gleaming Halloween Shachi, a Gamma Stratosaur, a Gamma Ursul, a Gamma Piter, two Gamma, three Gamma Borax, Gamma Babor, another Gamma Babor, and I'm assuming, okay, a Gamma Ivy Tross, two Gamma Twiddles, and I'm gonna be asking you guys, is this worth it? comparison to the other offers we've received and I think it's 
pretty obvious that this offer is not worth it. However, it's really not a bad offer. Uh, we've gotten offered really, really good stuff throughout the whole video. So yeah, I'm looking forward to other offers we could potentially have as the video goes on. Okay, now I'm gonna accept desired pieces trade and let's see what they have to offer. Gonna let me put the Obsidragon on screen. So they're offering an Alpha Ferroglyph, a Gleam Sapphire, and a Gleam Duskit. Oh, Pure Smart, the Gleam Sapphire. Okay, okay, and Pure Nimble, the Gleam Duskit, which is pretty good. Now I'm gonna be asking you guys, is this worth it? Yeah, in comparison to what we've received before, I think it's pretty obvious that this offer is not worth it. However, it's an okay offer. Gleam Sapphire is pretty rare, the rarest, uh, latest event Lumion added. Now let's accept Kit Litten's offer. Uh, let's see what they have to offer for Brats of Sidragon. So they're offering a Grinch and a Gleam Ikazune, and I take it that's the final offer, so the Grinch is pure nimble. Uh, just like Lucky's and the Gleam Ikazune is fur clever. Okay, now I'm gonna be asking you guys though, is this worth it? Well, simply by the fact we've been offered two Grinches and ads before in, in this video, I can say that that offer is not worth it. However, it's not a bad offer, it's a good offer compared to some of the other offers we've received in this video. But yeah, I think that's a really, really good offer. So now let's just, uh, let's accept the, the trade from AJG. And okay, so we have four Gleam Pyramids, a uh, Gleam Dusk, a Gleam Ikazune, a uh, Gamma Pyramid, um, what else? What else? What else? Oh, he caught the Gamma Pyramid. A Grinch. And... Oh, he also caught the Grinch. Okay. That's... That's interesting. A Gleam Duskit. Oh, he also caught the Gleam Duskit. Wow. Uh, did he catch everything? Yeah, he caught the Gleam Pyramid. He caught the Gleam Ikasune. He caught the other Gleam Pyramid. He caught the other <laughs> Gleam Pyramid. He also caught that Gleam Pyramid. He also caught the Gleam Eaglet. Bro, he also got the Gleam Duskit. Now I'm gonna be asking you guys, is this worth it? I mean, the offer is pretty good, however, uh, this is not worth it. Then again, Brad's of Sidragon, you cannot really assign a value to it since it's only one of a kind and I'm pretty sure it's not gonna leave Brad's inventory like ever, other than this this time. Now we got an offer from Nick, he's offering a Gleam Emerald, a Gleam Ikasune, a Gamma uh, Zuilong, two Gleam Gold El Iguanas, and a Gamma Scorb. Okay, the offer doesn't seem that bad. Well, I mean, it's okay. Wait, hold on. Oh, that's a Gamma Secret Ability Scorb. I also caught one of those. Nice. Okay, anyways, I'm gonna be asking you guys now, is this worth it? No, uh, this offer I think is clearly not worth it. By far the best offers were Ominous's and Young Wolf's offer at the start of the video. But yeah, I think this is gonna be the last offer I'm gonna be looking for, for in today's video. And yeah, let's just wrap the video up. Uh, let me cancel the trade and let me take out uh, the Obsidragon. Okay, so you can see here me running with the Obsidragon. But yeah, I think that's gonna be everything for today's video. Huge shout out to everyone who offered and huge shout out to Brad uh, for making this video possible. If it weren't for him lending me his custom Lumion, this video would not even exist. And also I wanna give a huge shout out to you guys for watching. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'm Armenti and we lit.